Why? Why did it only half birth? What is up the world? It's your friendly neighborhood slip gator here hanging out today doing stuff and things on the Ark Survival Evolved Pooping Evolved server. Hope you guys are having a good day. I'm having a really good day. I got a husky voice today. I'm a little bit hum. <clears throat> there we go. Now I sound less husky. Hope you guys are having a good day. I'm having a really good day. We're flying over to Poop City today. I feel like we should tame something today. I feel like we just should tame something. And so I was thinking about it. There's a couple things that I wanted to get done before we did tame something. We're just going to, I don't even know what we're going to do for taming, but we're going to tame something and I want to find something cool. Um, so we're going to take a look around for something today, but um, I want to start off be, by heading over to Poop City because we have um, a couple or no one, one new blueprint for um, a new long rifle. So right now you can see I've got, what are these guys? Apprentice long rifles. And I think we've got journeyman now. And I'm not really sure how they're going to work out. So we're going to come over here and let everything... Look, half a tower. We're going to every, let everything load in. Um, but while we do that, we'll start off as we always do today by having me take a moment to say thank you guys very much for all your likes and support on all the videos that we do. The Mad Max and the Ark and all the stuff and things. And uh, yeah, if you guys like this video, please... Oh, he pooped. Don't forget to hit the like button. If you haven't already, don't forget to subscribe. Where are my buildings? Can I have buildings? Are they here? Is it a thing that can happen? Spawn in the buildings. So as Poop City gets bigger and bigger and more and more intense, it is a bit of a loading concern, but we love it so much that we'll, we will wait for it. All right, so there we have, we have a floating dead body up there, which is, uh, that's an ominous sign, peeps. So, um, all right. Here we are at Poop City. Is it in the, the, well, no, it wouldn't be in the fabricate. Is it in the smithy, perhaps? Is it in best blueprints? Please be here. No, that's a journeyman simple thing. Apprentice shotgun. I heard about this guy. That's apprentice long neck rifle. And I have the apprentice. I heard that there was a journeyman one. Where where would it be? It wouldn't be in the fabricator. It is not in the smithy. Hmm. This is putting a big damper on my episode that I had planned out today. So, um, there's nothing named long neck in there. These are all saddles. There's nothing named long neck in there. These are other blueprints. There is something named long neck in here, but they're both primitive. Hmm, where is the blueprint that I've heard so much about? And we're back. Something's happening. <laughs> we're back over at Z's place. Look at the size of this barn, man. He's at the biggest barn of all time. It's a humongous barn. And he's got a big, I think, what is this? Is this a water tower? Look at the ladder. <laughs> it's like the longest ladder ever. What's in here? It is a water tower. I didn't even know he did this. He made a huge water tower. That's hilarious. Did he run water? All, did he run piping all the way down it? Wait, where's the pipe? Oh, it looks like he ran it inside the pillar. <laughs> That's cool, man. I love the water tower. All right. And I love that he's got some of the... He added some... Um, Different slopes to the front here. I'm sure he'll do the rest of it, too. This place looks really, really cool. All right, so the confusion was I had heard that the blueprint was at Poop, Poop City, and then I heard that it was at Z's place. So I was looking at Z's place in Poop City, and then I heard it was here. So I'm going to take a wild guess and say this is where the blueprint is. Are you here? There it is, peeps! Journeyman long rifle, long neck rifle. So 143 max durability. These have 123. And this is 165% damage. These are 129. So this is significantly more powerful. 690 metal ingots, 145 wood. It's going to cost so much metal to make these. Oh my gosh. And 181 hide. So a huge amount of stuff and things we've got to get going. Uh, we Well, we don't have to get it going. We've got it all going. Uh, we just got to head back to our base and build them now. So, oh no, that didn't go as well as I planned. All right, so I'm going to go ahead and uh, head back to the base. We'll build these guys up. I'll be our bees, peeps. And we're back with all the stuff and things in here we need. 1,400 roughly metal we're going to need for this. This is expensive. I'm interested to see how much XP we get here. What are we at, 106? I don't know if it changes based on the complexity of the gun. 106. Oh my god! 
That was like 800 experience, man. 825. 825 experience. This is the way to go, man. You get a lot of XP from this. If anybody needs to build, get XP, just build long rifles all day. Way better than elevators. All right. So we've got our long rifles. Um, it's under cover of darkness, of course. Um, we've got to get them painted. And we got to switch these guys out. But also, being a responsible server member, as I am, the first thing I'm going to do is go back to Z's and drop this very valuable blueprint off. Just uh, want to record this for the public record. Here I am, putting the blueprint back in his inventory. <laughs> that is, um, it's a pretty baller blueprint. So we, we really want to make sure we take care of it and we keep it safe. So, all right. Thank you, Zuljin. And we're back. Just getting stuff and things loaded up here. All right. So we got our guns. We've got to put our scope on this bad boy. So we got this guy. White with blue, this guy, blue with white, also white with blue, and this guy also white with blue with white. Wait, it's so confusing. So I'm not really sure how much damage and topor these guys do. I uh, guess we should probably try it out. Why is that? That guy's moving. Where are you going? Where's he going so quick? He's uh, just beating feet out of there. He must have heard me pull my rifle out. All right, let's go ahead. What, you, what level are you? You're only level seven. Oh, level 72. Well, you are level 72. Are you running too? They're scared of the rifle. Oh, oh, we got a couple of hot carnals down here. We got some hot carnal action going on. Oh yeah, nailed the dice to KB stopped. What level are you, Carno? Four. What? You couldn't take out a level four in one shot? You're supposed to be a super rifle. Why don't you come on, man? Oh, there we go. That was easy. And then we're not reloading for some reason. Okay. Little delay. We were just blown away by how amazing the gun is. What level are you, Carno? Forty. Hmm, level 40. Gotta get that headshot, yo. Here it comes. Oh, 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 he's moved his head. Oh, yeah! He's so aggressively upset now because of our shot to his brain. Oh, two shots to the brain. Oh, what are you snaking the grass? He's serpentined on me. I wish we could see... That's not bad. That's not bad. So what was that? Three shots? I can't remember. 17? Um, it's not bad, though. It's doing a def uh, definitely doing um, a good amount of damage. Now, we do have to be careful. Mazion was actually saying that the um, Topor, even with the... No, don't do that. Even with the uh, Tranquilizer darts, this uh, Long Rifle was doing so much damage, he was having a little bit of trouble. So we'll have to be a little bit careful. Um, well, I don't know if we'll be taming anything fly-worthy. I don't know if that's something we really need to worry about. Um, but like I said today, we are going to team something. I'm kind of excited to do it. Uh, what level are you, homie? 56! He's pretty high, but not high enough. Oh, also, I want to show you guys this. Finally, you may have remembered long, long ago in a galaxy far, far away, we tamed, uh, Bloodwing, and I finally got him up to 1,000 melee damage and 2,000 health. So he's kind of a force to be reckoned with now, to be honest with you. I've been, I've been leveling these guys up. I've been leveling Blue, or Bayou, um, his melee damage, which doesn't really go up that much. Um, and we still have got to return stupid big pigeon over to Draxiv. But, um, all right. So today we said we're going to take something. We're going to take Ouncey out since Ouncey's like pretty much, oh yeah, I gave Ouncey a paint job that I don't really like very much. You can tell me what you think of the down there, but I tried it out and I was like, eh, I don't know. I just painted it for funsies. We'll probably end up changing it. Um, so what I, like I was saying, what I want to do today is want to tame something. I don't really know what it is we want to tame. Something cool. Something high level, hopefully. And I guess I'm just going to go around and we'll see what we can find, peeps. And we're back. And I had to come and show you this, guys. <laughs> what is going on over here? I think this is BTC. Maybe. But look at all the dinos inside of here. What the crap is happening? He's got a raptor right there. I see a bunch of other ones named raptor, raptor, raptor. Uh, is there a way in to this, whatever this is? <laughs> uh, there's no door over here. Is the door in the middle? It's like an in the middle door. Okay, the door is in the middle. It's in the middle of the door. Oh my God, I know the frames, guys. I know, I know, tell me about it. Oh my God, who did this? What is happening? <laughs> 
Holy crap, man. The amount of scorpions and rexes and the, the amount of dinos in here is amazing. Whoever did this is amazing. It's just amazing they tamed up that many. That's this room. What's over in the... What is this? This is like a secret room with no entrance. There's just no way in. There's no way into the secret room. What the crap? Why is there a secret room with no way in? I sound like Joey. Whoa. Um, I don't know why there's a secret room with no way in. Did I miss it? Because it's just too laggy? I don't think I did. It looks like there's scorpions in there, and I swear to God, there's like no door. <laughs> there's no door. Secret scorpion room. You just can't even get in. It's not even possible. So I think this is BTC because he was talking about it, doing some stuff and things, and he was talking about, the reason I think it's him is because over here he's talking about building like a humongous platform. So what level are you, Carno? Are you a good Carno or a bad? You're a bad Carno. Bad. But I think this is him. But I couldn't, I couldn't just pass it by and not show you guys. Is that an alpha? What are you, thing? That is an amazing color. Uh, is that an alpha? No. It's a Paraceratherium. What are you? Level 100 RG. Well, we're not going to touch him. But this, I don't know, maybe it's just the way the light's shining on her. Oh, she's scared. That is a really cool color. I mean, it's way too too uh, low to care about, but really neat color. Oh, I think we're loading in the raptors again. Holy crap. So, I've been trying to level up Ounty as much as I can, and we're doing really good on her. Is it a her? Yeah, it's a her. We're doing really good on her and getting up some levels, but um, I was on my way over to the northern, the northwestern biome, the snow biome. And we're going to head over here because, you know, a while ago we lost Hungry. And wolves are really cool. And I thought we would get some. You know what? I have so many of these Rex Bone Skin helmets now that I've been throwing them away. I know. I know. So um, I was thinking we'd take a look around here for, for something to tame. And it's just been a while since we've been over here. And it's such a cool area. What do you got? What are you? Oh, wait. 116. Oh, my gosh. So high. I don't want a 116, though. I only want 120s. Um, yeah, you know what? It really stinks. At this point, we're so advanced on the Pooping Evolve server that we really only need high-level stuff and things. So I'm going to take a look around. Level 8 Lady Moose. Probably end up flying down low here. Another Mammoth wouldn't be bad. Well, this one's too little. So maybe we'll do some mammoth killing just to get some levels as well. And uh, come back when I find something cool. I'll be your beast, peeps. And we're back. There is a level 100 female dire wolf here. Now, in the last update, you can now pick up. Oh, we can always pick up dire wolves. Oh, wait. Where'd you go? They made it in the last update date so we can pick up. Sabertooth now, but we can pick up dire wolves as well. Oh, she's attacking me. I didn't know. Wait, what? I didn't know. Did she hit me every time? Only sometimes. <laughs> I'm trying to think of what we're going to do. I think we're going to try to head up to... Where's the volcano? Is that the volcano? I think it is. Can I look at my map while all this is going on? There's fur in my map. We're going to head up to the top of the volcano and drop this guy off. Oh, wait. There's dinos in there. Uh, that might not work either. It's not hurting me too bad. It's probably the best bet. We could drop it maybe further away from where... There's like an Anki and a Dodic over there. So we could drop it kind of far away from over there from them. And uh, then we should be able to find a perch to get it down. Uh, this will work out great, I think. And we're back. All right, I'm going to drop the dire wolf right uh, here. Pop up here. Get off. Pick the correct rifle. Oh, hello, dire wolf. Pew! Oh, no! Are you feeling upset because I've shot you? Uh, are you going to be able to make it up here? Oh, please no. <laughs> please don't. Pew, pew! Oh, perfect! This is working out great. Pew! Nailed that ace to KB stop. That's three darts. Oh, it's right in her nose. So cute. Four darts. I bet this takes six darts. I mean seven darts. No, this is six. Yeah, I definitely think this is going to take more than six darts. Probably 
maybe seven or eight. <laughs> Wait, this is taking so many. Wait, this is our journeyman rifle, right? Yeah, this is the journeyman long neck rifle. All right, I thought this would this would down this a lot faster. This is working out great. Ish. All right, there we go. It's down. It's down. All right, cool. So what's the next step? Oh yeah, feed it stuff and things. So I've got a bunch of prime over here already. We're saving it up on Ouncy. We can pop down. Oh, no, no, Ouncy, what are you doing, man? We can pop down right over here. And then probably would be not a terrible idea to go ahead and take this rock out. Just get it out of our way. And, all right, now we have unfettered access. And uh, we'll start feeding stuff and things. And I'll BRBs when it's tamed up, peeps. And we're back with Groupus. It's a strange name, you might think. She tamed out at 148. Now, this is a word salad of the words Gravidia and Lupus, which in Latin means pregnant wolf. Because that's what we're going to do. We're going to make her pregnant wolf. So, Groupus is our pregnant lady wolf. We've got her all ready to rock. Um, I got to bring her back. I was like trying to think how to do this best. I got to bring her back to the base anyway. So, I think I'm just going to bring her back now. Um, while she was taming up, I actually did go back down and look for another wolf. I didn't find one straight away. Um, so we're going to take a trip back to the base, drop off Groupus, and then we are going to come back. I like that name. We're going to come back, and uh, we're going to look for a dude wolf. What would our dude wolf's name be? And we're back with a limited amount of stamina and a 112th level male dial wolf who we have not yet named because we haven't tamed it. And I'm really hoping that we will be able to make it to the top of the volcano to... Do a similar, with the, use the same uh, strategic taming initiative, that, what does that mean, that we did for the last wolf. And that's what we're doing. I'm going to fly up here now. <laughs> and I have flown up here now, and we're running dangerously low on stamina. But I feel like this is going to work perfectly. Oh, nailed it, Ace Decay, be stopped. Is there a wolf? Are you down there? Are you a dude wolf? Am I gonna just pew pew? Pew! You can't get me, stupid dude wolf! Learn to climb a mountain. Why don't you know how to climb mountains? I guess you're not a mountain wolf. Or a mountain goat. So we're gonna down this bad boy. I'm gonna say it's gonna take about eight trank darts to get this guy down. I'm gonna take a wild guess. And I'm interested in making... Oh, no, wow! He went down so much quicker than the lady wolf. Uh, do you have anything on you that we can make to feed this wolf that we can make to feed the when the words don't work uh, That we can give to the wolf for feeding it with your Whatever you have is this gonna work? Oh, uh, we don't have much time on any of these guys. Oh, we got some down here All right, these guys two three four and then one of these all right dude wolf 112th level not bad not bad These aren't super wolves yet, but we're gonna get there. We're gonna start off with these so we're going to have to go get some more prime meats, though. Um, remember, these prime meats are on four times timers because they're inside of the inventory of a dinosaur. And so... Oh, no! No, we can't drop that! Oh, crap. Did you drop through the world? Oh, no, you didn't. Oh, thank goodness. Where are you, helmet? Come back to me. Come back to me, my helmet. There it is. Oh, wow. It's all weird looking now because... Oh, thank goodness. It still has the thing on. Okay, okay. Everything's fine. Put you back inside of... Yeah! Actually, we'll squirt you right there because that's way better. All right, so the moral of the story is more prime meat. We got to think of a name for it, and then we'll bring it back to the base when it's tamed, and we will um, make it have babies with Groupus. And I'm really excited! And we're back with Beepus, which obviously stands for Beatus Lupus, which means happy wolf. And then we have Groupus, pregnant wolf. <laughs> Enable wandering to mate. Now, these guys are gonna mate in a much smaller area, and I'm not actually sure if we can fit them through a doorway. This is a question that I have not. Can we ride you through a doorway? Oh, suck it, Slip Gator. We can't ride him through a doorway. Will you follow me through this doorway? Pretty, pretty please. More than anything, this is what I want. But you know what we'll do? Maybe we'll try this, and then we'll get it lined up. Are you ready? And we'll run! Come in! Come in the doorway, come in the doorway. Oh, I want to get him in here so bad. I don't think that they'll... Now you're... Now you, seriously? You've seriously blocked my way? Is that how it's going to be? All right, hold on. One more one, one more chance. One more chance. 
Come on. Come in here. No. All right. So, can we get on you now? Are you really? Is this really happening? Move closer to ride. Ride. Change name. No, we got to ride it there for a second. There it is. <laughs> he just pooped. And I can't ride. I'm going to have to break the wall for realsies. So, what I want what I wanted to try to do is um, get him in this room to make it easier for them to breed so they wouldn't walk around so much. Now that we've got the broken wall, I think this is probably like a perfect opportunity. We'll just be able to build a wall back inside of there. Do we have any extra walls? Let's go find out. Down here, we've got to have a wall of some sort. Well, we don't have a stone wall. We'll just use a wooden wall for now. That way we can break it to get them back out again. But um, I figured in the mating pen that we have up there, it's just going to be too big. I know when you put them on wander, if they wander around too much or too far away from each other, they just won't mate anymore. So um, now I haven't done any mammal breeding. and I haven't really watched any videos about it, so I'm not really sure exactly how this is going to work. Um, but I'm confident that we can make it happen. You know, nature will take its course. So um, what we will do now is we will just enable wandering on you. Enable wandering on you. And it's happening already! They're doing it together. Don't watch them. It's rude and weird. All right, so the mating process is begun. All the stuff and things are happening. They look they look totally fine. And uh, we'll be our bees. Just a second, Pete. And we're back. Oh, oh, and she's gestating. The gestation process has begun. What does that mean? It means she's preggers. She's a preggers wolf. And I think we could probably take them off wander now, just so they're not wandering. Can you ride a prego wolf? I don't even know. Can you be ridden? Yes. I'm riding a pregnant lady. Wolf. <laughs> All right. So we can't get these guys out, which is fine. We'll just leave them inside of here. Oh, I opened the door. Get out. Walk out the door. Can you duck? Why? Right, come on. You're a smart dog. Duck. All right, you keep guard. So the gestation process has begun. I'm assuming for real. Oh my gosh. Game. I'm stuck in here. We don't need these campfires anyway. We don't need them. There's not even a reason for it. Um, so I'm assuming that she's going to get more preggers as she gets bigger. Uh, let's just take a look here at the body as it gets larger. And uh, when she's ready to squirt out a baby, I'll be our beast peeps. And we're back. The gestation process is almost over. And having not edited the video yet, I'm not able to see if we have a distinctly more preggers looking group as or not. But I do know that if I don't go get meat soon, we will have a dead baby. So let's go ahead and get some meat because the baby's going to squirt out any moment. And I feel like I'm going to miss the birth now. Uh, let's just grab three stacks for nowsies. Don't have a baby yet. Oh, no, 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 no. Don't have a baby yet. Maybe we'll have a surprise baby when we get back. Did you have a baby? Where's the baby? Oh, it's halfway out your butt. Oh, no. It only half birthed. Why? Why did it only half birth? Are you here? You're in your... Oh, no. We have to pull it out. Get the forceps. There's three of them. It had triplets. Are you kidding me? I'm imprinting. Uh, one. Uh, imprint. Two. Uh, give it food. Really fast. Okay. You need food. Really fast. And then you... Uh, I can't get to you. Three. I can't get to you. Uh, no. Imprint. It had triplets. I can't believe it. I can't even believe this is the thing. Oh my gosh, we need so much more meat. There's so many things to be done now. Fires, get out of the way. You're too many fires in the way. Uh, wall, be gone. We have triplets. Can I ride you out with the triplets in your butt? Okay. So where have these all these triplets? Look, there's three of the babies. They're so amazing. I can't believe we had triples. Look at them. Three babies. Three amazing, perfect little babies. Named one, two, and three. The maturation process has begun. Are you? How hungry do you get? Oh, very hungry. Oh, they're very, very hungry triplets. Oh no, this is this is. Uh, no, it's fine. It's fine. We've got plenty of meats. We've got plenty of meats in here. Oh, I can tea it now. T t t t t t t t. We're teeing it. Tea is the most amazing thing that's ever happened. 
right now, especially Oh, they've come to me! Come to me, babies. Here, eat more of this. Would you like some meat? I have all sorts. There you are. Enjoy it. Enjoy it. Know the value of it and the greatness of the meat that is here. You're so vulnerable and small. And I feel like we need to get Groupus and Beepus over here to help you guys be be better babies. Oh, Groupus, you've, you've grown. Let's increase your health because that is good. All right, all right. Why? Uh, why, 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 why? You. Tease. Come here, baby direwolf. Oh, why are you all named baby direwolf? I'm pretty sure I named you. Stop it with the wandering. That's no, there's no need of that. So we have babies now. We have to make them grow. And they will enjoy life. And this is amazing. Um, we do need to take a moment to calm down from our triplets. Which I can't believe we had triplets. Uh, all right. Let's take a look here. What are you? You are a level 158. So that's like what... These aren't perfect tames. 158, 158, 158. So we... I guess we don't know if they're... If they're fraternal or identical, 1,500 health. We could probably just look at their max stats and see 1,500.5, 1,500.5, 1,500.5. Then let's take a look. Do they all have 337 and 130 at the bottom there? 337, 130. 337, 130. So it looks like they're identical triplets. Unbelievable identical triplets. Oh, my gosh. So crazy. Let's give you a little bit more meats. So we have to wait for them to get to that 10%, that magical 10% maturation level before they will eat from um, from the trough. But at the same time, these guys are going to have a lot of meaty requirements. There's going to be a lot to do. Um, I think we'll pull them up here. Pugly, you're going to need to peace out, homie, because we need the room, and you're just a big fat bird. All right. All right, come over here. We'll bring you guys up to these troughs, or we could just put triple troughs down here, probably. It probably is the best idea. We'll build a couple more troughs. So much to be done with triplets in the house. All right, I'm going to get some stuff and things ready for these guys. Oh, they're running. Did you see that little cute running? Is one bigger? Are you the big one? All right, well, it doesn't matter. So flustered. Um, I'm going to go ahead and take out probably one of my T-Rexes, get some more meat. Oh, you've grown up as well. Let's increase your melee damage. Um, and, yeah, get some more meats. Build a couple more troughs for them so they have enough. And, uh, yeah, I'll be our beast, peeps. It's so crazy. And we're back. <clears throat> and we're back. And I've got names for these guys now. Unum. Latin for one. Duo. Latin for two. Tribus. Or tribus. Latin for three. And the other thing I was checking, we checked earlier, their stats are all the same. But um, Tribus is a dude... And Duo is a dude, but Unum is a lady. And so they've started to mature. I filled up. I put um, another three more troughs over here. So there's actually four feeding troughs. And I went out on Y-Tooth, and I got all of them completely full. So there's huge, huge, huge amount of meat here. And then um, these guys are all following. Oh, I'm stuck on tails. These guys are the story of my life. They're all following... Group us, who we're going to set to passive, and then we will just set beep us to neutral, and might as well level him up a little bit. We'll give him a little bit of melee damage in there, and we'll get you leveled up. We'll give you a little bit of health in there, and then um, I think these guys are all set for neutral already, if I'm not mistaken. I am wrong. They're passives. So we'll set these guys to neutral, too, just to guard the pups, but they should be good to go now. They're over 10% mature. And they're growing up. And it's so an amazing thing that we did today. I'm so happy that you guys hung out with me today to do it. It was really, really fun. I can't believe we have triplets. It was unbelievable. So I'm inside the butt of this. Uh, yeah, okay. Let's uh, maybe. All right, here we go. Yeah, that works. And there's tails. So anyway, that's going to be it for today, guys. I hope you had fun hanging out. If you guys liked the video, please don't forget to hit the like button. Feel free to share and favorite it as you see fit. And may the...